Hello friends, in this video we will see the behavior of call versus branch in an activity. For example, I am going to create an activity. Uh, for example, activity name is um, parent one activity. Okay, so I am going to create a one activity. My class name is SBA as usual, SBA loans, okay, car loan, fine, click on create and open, this is my activity name, parent one, or you can give it your activity name A3, A or B, whatever you wish, so in this activity, I am just writing a simple basic steps, one is page new, another one is page remove, that's it, I am not writing more than these two, what happened let's create again okay now i'm just writing page new something page name is hello in the pages and classes i am defining hello the class name is sba etc okay your wish you can give it as any class name but i am giving here okay something loan request page new okay now after this i am adding a one more step i want to call one activity i want to call one activity from this activity so i will call what is the activity name okay call so for example i have a lot of other activities in the work loan class okay let's see is there any activities in the work loan class or you can create another activity uh, child one child one let's create child one activity click on create and open so here page new c page now in the pages and classes c page data country class that's it c page that's it i'm not doing anything save i'm calling child one activity from my parent one activity that's all click on save now after this call child one what i am doing is i just want to add a one more method i just want to add a one more step page remove page remove the page name is a c page page remove the page name is c page save run an activity actions click on run so what i did i created a two activities one is a parent one another one is a child one i am calling child one activity from a parent one activity by using this call method by using this call method now i am running this activity just click on trace and click on run now just see the tracer okay as usually 
what happened activity execution is completed or not activity execution is completed but what is the tracer now let me trace it again let me run the activity okay now see this one activity execution is begin car loan the first step method page new executed now call child one that means uh, my child activity execution is started call child one my child activity execution is started that means uh, child one right activity begin step begin page new step end activity end now the call child one step end that's it now the last step page remove step begin and step end and activity end so you can call one activity from another activity using the call method now what i am going to do is what i am going to do is just open the clipboard open the clipboard in a standard thread only because you selected as a standard thread now where is my c page hello page is there why because your first method name is hello page new hello so that's why the page is present that's why the page is present where is the c page because at the step number three you have removed the c page that's why the page got removed from the clipboard now what i am going to do is i want to call the same child one activity using a branch method using a branch b r a n c h branch okay this branch not that branch some people will confuse in the interview point of view what is a branch so again people are talking about that is used for the multiple developers can you start working on that okay that is okay but this branch method is different branch child one just click on save now again close all and tracer also pass clear now again i want to run the same activity again now actions run this time i have used the branch trace click on run go to the see this one activity begin step begin step end now the branch child one activity execution is started activity execution is started branch child one activity begin step begin step end activity end see automatically step end that main activity is also end main activity is also end now very simple difference is when you use the call when you use the call from your main activity the control can come back to the main activity once your calling activity is completed once your calling activity is completed that means once the child one activity execution is completed the control comes back to the your main activity which is nothing but a parent activity that's it and it will continue to the execution of the remaining steps which are pending but in case of branch control never come back to the main activity control never come back to the main activity the moment the moment branch instruction is identified by the prpc during the activity execution okay the rule resolution algorithm identify that activity then that activity execution is started once that activity execution is completed your main activity execution is automatically completed your main activity execution is automatically completed that's why see at step number 3 page remove where is that page remove it was not executed it was not executed now if you want you can just see you can find out the clipboard c page 
see this one SBI loan data country so this is the main difference between the call versus branch in your activities so depends upon your requirement or I mean depends upon your need okay branch is suitable here call is suitable here etc based on that based on that just I'm just giving one example also for example in your activity total step number total steps is 15 after six steps if you want to call an activity once that activity execution is completed okay once that activity execution is completed your I mean your requirement is you no need to execute all these steps again you no need to execute all these steps again then you can use branch simply you can use branch there why again control come back to your main activity and the remaining steps should be executed forcefully executed if if that is if if uh, your requirement is not that then you can use the branch okay the major difference is control never come back to the main activity when you use the branch once the activity execution is completed control comes to the main activity when you use the call control comes to the main activity when you use the call i hope at least you understand what is branch and what is call in the activities thank you